Hello everyone, I'm Richard and today this video will be a bit different than the others. I'll let you guys know more about me. I'm Richard, I'm from Kolkata, India and I have come to Canada for my masters at University of Windsor. And before I move on, let's do a recap. The hardest thing was to say goodbyes. Anyway, so this is the night before my flight. Me and Babai finalizing everything only to forget the things I did not bring to Canada. Kolkata doesn't have a direct flight to Toronto so I had a 4 hour layover in Dubai. After 24 hours of airborne, I finally reached Toronto. Got picked up by my uncle and aunt. The first thing I did was to find an accommodation at Windsor. On the way back, I visited my sister at London and saw the Western University where she studies. Came back, got my first Apple product. Went go-karting for the first time, visited downtown Toronto with my brother. Spent Christmas with my family, gifted myself a DJI gimbal, went ice skating, fell twice, got hurt, couldn't walk the next day, visited the Art Gallery of Ontario, ate something whose name I don't know how to pronounce, spent the New Year's at Nathan Phillips Square, which ended with fireworks. The next morning we went to the temple. It's the 2nd of January. I am moving to Windsor permanently for the next two years. My apartment is in a street called Josephine Avenue and it's really a good place to stay. Tata. Bye bye. Thank you. I'm gonna need it. My uncle and my sister came to drop me off and Ta -da. they left me. Finally, for the first time in my life, I would be staying alone without anyone's interference in my life. And I am extremely scared and I don't know how will I survive. So after Four hours maybe I set up my room. This is how it looks right now. Yeah, I'm happy I did a good job. Orientation day. It's the 3rd of January. I'm walking towards my university for the first time. It's 7 in the morning. It's raining right now. It doesn't feel much, but it's cold and windy. I'm done with the orientation. It was really good. I'm roaming around the campus to explore. Found my way to the swimming pool. I never thought I would get a chance to swim again. The university is a bit strict about the timetable schedule it has for every event. I gotta come back here later. At 3 a.m. in the morning, me and my roommates decided that we should go on an adventure. This is the Canada-US border. You can see Detroit behind me and this is the Detroit River. It's a really beautiful view at night and the weather was absolutely freezing. I'll end my video here. Those of you stayed till the end, thank you for watching. The main reason I'm making these videos is to let my parents know that I am okay and I will be okay here. So see you in the next one. Till then, enjoy this scenic beauty.